guys, it's Rafika. Welcome back to my channel. As you can see from the title, today we're going to be testing out the brand new Fenty Beauty bronzers and the new Kilowatt highlighters. So if you want to see that, keep watching. I went to Sephora, to Sephora a couple of days ago. And I bought... Sorry guys, I'm like reorganizing a little bit because my desk is a little... She's a little crowded. Oh, and if you aren't drinking Essentia, what are you doing? I got water on my upper lip. I hope it doesn't mess up my makeup. Okay, I'm back. So, I bought the two hot, the two bronzers that were for the 300 foundations. And I got Bajan... Okay, I don't know how to say this. Is it Bajan Gal or Bajan Gal? And then Caramel Cutie. And then I also got the Fenty Beauty by Rihanna Kilowatt, the Freestyle Highlighter Duo in Mo, Mo Honey and Afternoon Snack. So I'm going to swatch all these on my arm first so you guys can see that. And also for the bronzers are $30 and the highlighter was $34. And I also got these little samples for 250 points, the SK2, wait, focus. The SK, okay, it's not focusing, but it's like the SK2 Essence that is like everyone with clear skin uses, so and it's like a hundred dollars a bottle. So I'm glad I got my little sample. But wait, guys, we need to talk about ah, I'm breaking the box. Okay, but guys, we have to talk about this. Oh, it's dirty. Hold on, we have to talk about this packaging. Like what? This is beautiful. Okay, so this one is Caramel Cutie, which is the lighter bronzer. So I'm going to swatch that all on my arm. So this is Caramel Cutie. Oh, it doesn't look that dark. Let me put some more. Oh, yeah, there it is. This is Caramel Cutie. I'm so bad at arm swatches. I'm so sorry, guys. And everyone watching this is like, what is she doing? Honestly, I don't know. And also has the same packaging. I love the packaging. I also love the shape because it's the same shape as their highlighters. But actually, I think Bajan Gal is lighter. I don't know. This is Caramel Cutie. This is Bajan Gal. I think they just have different undertones, actually, now that I'm looking at it. And now I'm going to swatch Bajan Gal. Ooh, I like this one. It's very warm. I feel like Bajan Gal is more warm and Caramel Cutie is more cool toned. Look. Okay, and now let me swatch the highlights. Literally every Fenty launch, I was... I almost didn't review this one because I felt like I was really late, but then I was like, I always do the Fenty reviews and I know a lot of people look forward to them, so I was like, I'm doing it. Oop. Okay, let me step back and do it. <laughs> okay, this is the highlighter. Okay, you guys can't really see it, but it's the same packaging as the other highlighters. Okay, this is Afternoon Snack. This is Mo Honey. Mo Honey, Afternoon Snack, Bajangal, and Caramel Cutie, I think. Not positive. Yep, that was right. Boom. Oh, well, let me guys show you it in the pan. This is Mo Honey. This is Afternoon Snack. Mo Honey, Afternoon Snack. Okay. So I'm going to bronze each side of the face using each product. So let me get my two brushes. So I usually use this one to bronze. This is my Sigma powder slash blush brush F10. Or I can use the M527. This is the one James Charles uses to bronze. 
there's a little powder in it but i feel like that will make the biggest difference but just like really big let me get two brushes that actually compare to each other hold on okay i'm just gonna start with this one and see where it goes we're gonna start with because we started with caramel cutie already let's start with caramel cutie on my left side putting it on the brush tapping off excess let me get oh let me just look in this mirror Oh, okay. Also, I'm not the best, best at bronzing, so it looks crazy. I'm sorry. Oh, that looks... Oh. Why does that look like so much on camera, but not in person? Okay, I definitely brought it down a little too far. But on camera, it looks like I did like a lot. But in person, it does not look like that. Hold on. Let me bring it a little closer. Okay. Anywhere where it looks too low, because it doesn't really look like that in person, it looks slightly like that, but on camera it looks like huge difference. But I low-key do like the color though. And so now I'm gonna clean off this brush, I'll be right back, and then we'll go into Fashion Girl. Okay, now I'm gonna take Fashion Girl and put it on this side. I feel like I'm low-key out of practicing bronzing just because I have not been bronzing. I've just been using um, cream contour. So I haven't even been using powder like this on my cheeks. So It's weird because I feel like this one's not showing up as much. It looks very like red, like kind of low key looks like blush to me. I don't know if I'm just bugging, but let me stop laying this on so thick, but like, oh my gosh. Okay, so I don't bronze my forehead because I already feel like I have a small forehead because my headpiece covers most of my forehead. So, okay, so left side is Caramel Cutie. That's this side that needs to be cleaned up. Actually, let me just clean that up right now with some powder. I feel like this one does not need to be cleaned up like that. But I can't. I'm looking in the viewfinder too. I don't know. Like, I feel like this one's very orange let me look just like in my mirror I'm sorry I think I sound like so confused in this right now but this one just looks redder to me I don't know maybe I need to apply more okay so now I'm picking up more of the Jeanne Gal by okay I'm just gonna stop one kind of looks this one looks more yeah this one is definitely the warmer one this one is cooler but I like both of them oh my gosh my little acne spots are coming out that's not cute I left that bake on for way too long I low-key forgot okay so I'm still not sure which one I like more or which one looks better can you guys comment down below which one you guys think looks better or which one you think looks better as my bronzer I'll let you see again this will do side a side no not side a side B just say the name this is caramel cutie see it from the front this is Bajan Gao Give me your little reviews down below. And now we're gonna go into the other highlighters. Let me get my highlighting brushes. I have not used this one yet and I'm so excited to. Okay, wait, I just peeped both of these brushes are the same brush. And can you guys look 
at the difference of the shade. This is the Morphium 501. This one's dirty, so I'm going to use this one. When you swatch these two products, um, what is this one again? Afternoon Snack kind of feels more like a gel, and this, and then Mo Honey feels more like a powder. But I'm not sure about that, so I'm going in with my Morphium 501 in Afternoon Snack. See, it's kind of applying like a powder too. Interesting. And then we're going to put that on the left cheek. Oh! Oh, okay. Wow. That just came out the gate like boom. I'm here. Okay. And now let's go to Mo Honey on my Anastasia Beverly Hills A23 brush. Oh, okay, again, wow. This is the first time I've ever tried any of um, Rihanna's highlighters, like not the extra sparkly glittery ones, like these are the actual normal highlighters I've ever tried. Oh, like ev not normal, but you know, everyday wear highlighters. Okay, so Mo Honey! Oh, but I mean, it's back. Ah! Wait, you know what? I gotta look at this in my camera. Okay, so now I'm looking at my camera. Oh! And these highlighters, I like Mo Honey more on camera. It looks more bright, it looks brighter than. Afternoon snack. I low-key don't like highlighters of this. Like, I do like them, but sometimes for me, it's harder for them to look like they're blended out and for them also to, like, I don't know, just something about them I don't really like. Um, now I'm just trying to look at the bronzer. This one's definitely, because it's cooler, it looks darker. I definitely did apply too much, too. Sorry, guys. Okay, now I'm gonna look at the pictures. Caramel Cutie, like I said before, it looks like it's barely there. Like, I guess that's what bronze is supposed to do, though. It's just supposed to warm your face. But it looks like... Let me show you guys on picture. I guess. Like, I don't know if you guys can see it. But it just looks like it's barely there. But then, when I go to this side, as you can see, the highlight is dimmer, too. It looks like it comes up more in my skin tone. I can't really decide, but I'm definitely going to post this video so you guys can tell me. But I think I like Caramel Cutie more than Bajan Girl. Oh, wait. Which side is which? I think this is Caramel Cutie. Is it, though? <laughs> um, this is a very good question. Whatever. I'll just watch the video back. But whatever bronzer on this side I like more and the highlighter on this side I like more, which is Mo Honey. This is Caramel Cutie. Let me stop. I'm not going to doubt myself. This is Caramel Cutie. So I like Caramel Cutie and Mo Honey more. I like Bajan Girl too, but I just can't decide if it looks good on my skin tone. You guys can tell me down below how you guys feel about it. And I'm definitely going to return one because I don't need to. And also, I'm going to factor in the fact that it's about to be summer. So your girl's about to be... She's about to be tan. I get very tan during summer, so I might just have to keep... Caramel Cutie regardless, even if you guys think it looks better on this skin tone, but I really want to know your guys' thoughts because I can't decide on what I'm, like, feeling more. So comment down below which one you guys think looks better and comment down below how you guys feel about this little highlighting duo and which side you like better. I was going to finish my face, but it's kind of late and I kind of, you know, want to go to sleep because I have school tomorrow. So... Thank you guys so much for watching. Please don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe. And when you subscribe, hit the bell right next to it so you can join the Feek Squad. Comment down below if you do hit, if you have those notifications on so you can see every time I post. Thank you guys so much for watching. And please don't forget to comment your thoughts. Mwah. Peace out, Girl Scouts. Ooh. Do you guys think I should also stop doing this at the end of my videos? I'm not sure if people think it's dumb, but it's just like, I don't know, I just started it one day and I was like, peace out, Girl Scouts. And then, I don't know, I just kept doing it, so it's kind of like my thing. But do you think I should be like, peace out, Feek Squad? Or nothing at all? Um, <laughs> tell me what you guys think in the comments. Thank you guys for watching. Bye, guys.